How do you make a partially filled pipe full? Well then, partially filled pipe is usually a gravity fed application. Mm -hmm. What I mean by that, it's probably not a pumped flow. So the liquid basically flows downhill. Mm -hmm. A typical application is say a building effluent. That's right. Everything that goes down the drain, including the old porcelain receptacle, whoosh, goes down a gravity fed, partially full pipe out the back door to the city sewer system. Well then, the typical flow meter needs a full pipe. Hmm. One way to address this is to install a trap. You know, a trap. You don't? An example of a trap is that U-shaped pipe under your kitchen sink. It's basically there to catch that wedding ring that you drop down the drain. Well, that full pipe section is there primarily to keep the sewer gases from coming up. Whew. Using the same concept, you can modify this plumbing configuration for your project to always make a partially full pipe full without restricting the flow. Thus, giving you a full pipe condition to install your flow meter. Now, note, the trap does not alter your flow rate, but because it's still a gravity-fed application, it'll probably be low flow rates. So, keep this in mind, so when you select your flow meter, an example of low flow meters would be a magnetic flow meter or a clamp-on ultrasonic flow meter. Now, if you don't have the ability to make these modifications, well, then you will need to consider an open channel or an error velocity flow meter system, which we'll talk about in another episode. So, did you enjoy this video? Well then, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.